A busy day for Governor-elect Mary Fallon. She is in Tulsa this hour, but was in Oklahoma City just a few hours ago. She made a stop at the Science Museum Oklahoma to visit with our state's special talents. Our Jacqueline Sitt was at the Fun for Families event, where a rising star gave quite a show, I hear, Jacqueline. And Ed, that rising star is Edmund's very own Grace and Chance, and he tells me his life has been a big roller coaster, but he likes roller coasters, so he's having fun, and that fun hasn't stopped, especially at the Science Museum, where he sang for hundreds of kids. You never enjoy one of Oklahoma's favorite sons is back home for the day, doing what he does best. Life has been a whirlwind for Grace and Chance, who flies back and forth to L.A. from Oklahoma. But this performance is more than just a show. It's history in the making. I'm excited to be back, and I'm just uh, so thankful, you know, to be here today, you know, to, to support the inaugural of Mary Fallon. And I hope I said that right, inaugural. Just waiting to be exposed. He has the status of a shining star, but his words are as honest as the music he shares with the world. I want, you know, people to come home and feel like they just watched, like, a real show and something that, you know, because I, I, I try to get the message, you know, that I'm not artificial, you know, I'm real. The music that I'm writing and creating is real, you know, it comes from me. For the Edmund native, it's the first pre-inaugural performance and the very first meeting with the first woman governor of Oklahoma. So excited to meet the uh, the governor. I can say that I'm going to meet the governor. It's so cool. <laughs> so uh, I'm very excited. An excitement also felt by the governor-elect Mary Fallon herself after watching a 13-year-old pop star on the piano. So you're incredible, absolutely incredible. We wanted you because you're an Oklahoman. You're doing great things, and you're an inspiration to all the other young children that are here today. So much. Things we wanted to do on this inauguration was to highlight great Oklahomans to show all of Oklahomans, especially our young children who are here today at this family fun event, that you can be anything you want to be if you work hard, you persevere, and, and you dream. Really big dreams. It's such a great honor and such a great event, you know, to be here. It's just, it's, uh, it's a great event and one that I'll always remember. Thank you guys. And Grayson is heading back to L.A. first thing in the morning to continue rehearsals for his tour starting at the end of this month. Ed?